Division One. They were making the short trip uh, geographically to the league's bottom club, Halifax, who haven't scored a goal in nine hours of league football, with a ground capacity of 5,000 compared with the 50,000 of Old Trafford. Our commentator, Clive Tilsley. Put out by Webb. It's running into the space that McLeod vacated and brought that by Craig Fleming, and that's a free kick in a position of some promise for Manchester United. Both the United fullbacks, Dennis Irwin and Clayton Blackmore, looking to get involved. Webb and it's there too. It's Blackmore! Clayton Blackmore with a strike really out of character with Manchester United's performance so far. What a beauty! Get close to it. Richardson eventually winning out against it. Oh. And Halifax Town now have an opportunity to show us what they can do from a free kick just outside the penalty area. To be Dave Evans. Oh, he's there! An equaliser for Halifax. Late and caught by a beautifully flighted free kick from the Halifax skipper, Dave Evans. Martin. It's as good a sustained period as they've had in the game. Dennis Irwin. Like more, and it's hit by McLeod. Oh, that'll make them feel a whole lot better. Brian McLeod, crisply taken chance. And there may be more to come. Irwin again. Fulcher couldn't cut it out. McClare may be a terrific effort, a good save by Brown. <laughs> Webb in near post. It's it. Suddenly it's raining goals. Neil Webb makes it 3-1. Maybe off his shoulder. It was comfortable enough in the end, wasn't it? But gosh, they left it really late. Last uh, three minutes, those two goals. Right, let's carry on then with the uh, Rumbelows League Cup. And a, and a half thousand in the shade last night to witness Halifax Town's biggest game in years. Unfortunately, there were about 300 others outside, locked out because police said the ground was full. Several fans had apparently got in using forgeries, leaving supporters with genuine tickets angry and disappointed. With Hillsborough in mind, the police say they had no choice but to deny them entry. I can sympathise with them very much because I saw very little of the game. Uh, and anybody who's played for a ticket and hasn't seen it, it's very, very distressing, I know, particularly it being a good game. I can only apologise. Uh, we did our best under the circumstances. It was a situation that was given to us with no notice whatsoever. We tried to do our best. The police did very well. We feel we did our best as well. Now Halifax say anyone with a genuine ticket should write to the club in closing the counterfoil. They'll get the option of either a refund or a ticket to the return like at Old Trafford. As for last night's game itself, town more than matched their mighty visitors, even though they went a goal down to Clayton Blackmore's 25th minute free kick. Clayton Blackmore with a strike really out of character with Manchester United's performance so far. What a beauty. But anything United could do, it seemed town could do better. Be Dave Evans. Oh, he's there! An equaliser for Halifax. Leighton caught by a beautifully flighted free kick from the Halifax skipper, Dave Evans. Then just three minutes from time, Dennis heartbreak Irwin. for Halifax, two goals Blackmore. for United. The first, a volley from Brian McLeod. And finally, a somewhat fortunate header from Wait Neil Webb. Neil. The final score, 3-1 to United.